Coming home from the hospital, a Charlotte man has reached the next step of his recovery without his wife after the two were hit by a woman accused of driving drunk and crashing into them on their wedding day. WBTV has been on your side keeping you updated on this since it happened April 28th. Should have been the best day of Sam and Eric Hutchinson's lives celebrating their love on Folly Beach, but Sam, as you know by now, did not survive. WBTV anchor Siobhan Bryan joins us here in studio with the latest on Eric's recovery after being in critical condition. Siobhan? It's just a tragic story, mm -hmm. and the smile on Sam and Eric's faces says it all on her wedding day. The day was all about love, and now that love has turned into support for two grieving families. Now, yesterday, Eric's mother took to GoFundMe to give an update on his condition. She started by thanking the community for the, quote, tremendous outpouring of love, support, and overwhelming generosity. But more than anything, she says, they just miss Sam. From the accident, Eric received multiple injuries, including two broken legs, broken bones in his face, broken vertebrae in his back, brain bleeds, several cuts. He's received stitches. These pictures shared on his GoFundMe, they show him and the two others hurt in the hospital. He's now physically recovering at home while trying to come to terms with the loss of his new wife. Ben Garrett is recovering in the burn unit where he underwent surgery. Thankfully, Brogan Garrett only suffered minor injuries. He's only 17 years old. Now, Eric's mom adds while he's recovering at home, he's also planning Sam's funeral along with her family, and those plans aren't final <sighs> just yet. And we've been telling you a GoFundMe has now been set up. There are two funds for both Eric and Sam's families, and you can find both of those on our website. And the story just doesn't get any easier no, no matter how many days no. pass. It's and so senseless, so unnecessary. Yeah. Absolutely. DUI. Siobhan, thank you.